I'll just keep kiting you around this rock. You got a neat color. I'm into it. Hey, yo, guys. JC Hooligan coming from the Dirty Jurors. Another episode of Ark Survival Ascended on the Beach Bob's Ascended map. Hope you guys are having a great day. I'm having a great day. Thank you guys for coming to hang out with me. Please don't forget to smash that thumbs up button if you're new here. Don't forget to subscribe. In the last episode, we tamed up Goliath and we found Jessica. I'm so happy. What a great episode. We finished the fence. So this area is safe. And in today's episode, I feel like we need to get ourselves a flyer finally. Um, I would like to maybe just start with a Pteranodan. So why don't we see if we can build a Pteranodan saddle immediately or thereabouts. Shut up, everybody. My God. God, you're loud. Uh, let's see here. How much uh, do we have enough? Stuff? I, dude, that bird sounds like a person talking. I say it every episode. I don't like that bird's noises. It creeps me out. Uh, I feel like hide might be a situation. Did we even learn a pteranodon saddle? I bet you guys we may did not. Nope. Let's learn a raptor. The. Uh, so we need. Oh yeah, I don't think we have enough hide for this situation. Uh, definitely not. All right, let's go ahead and throw that stuff back up in there. Let's take Jessica out. Actually, yeah, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Let's t You know what? Let no, 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 no. It's not fine. Let's do this. How much did we need to build the Pterano Dan saddle? PT? We need 75 chitin slash keratin. So why don't we take half? And that? And five! We've done it. Okay, why don't we take... Wait... 230 hide and we need 125 fiber so why don't we grab why don't we just grab a stack of fiber like so all right so now we have this stuff then why don't we take jessica out now and murder the heck out of things and get some um hide that way jessica where are you oh god you know i know i know it's really bright you guys but it looks so cool with the light filtering through the trees this game i am so in love with arc again I've never, like, not been in, like, love, love with Ark, but I definitely... It's like we went to the, see the... A marriage counselor? I don't know. I think those guys might make things worse. I don't know. I'm not going to say anything bad about counseling, because I'm very much... Oh! Iz, what are you doing way down here? You be careful. There's bad hombres afoot. I'm into this. Um, I think I am going to turn the clouds off, though. And remember, guys, remember it's the R dot volumetric cloud? Zero. Boom. And then your frames will usually jump up a few. Nothing spectacular. Now, we can turn off the ground clutter. Uh, but I want to leave a little bit of something going on here. I don't know. You know, I'm running steady in the, like, 50s. So, it's fine. It's all good. It's not a big deal. Um, so, I think we need to go on a bit of a beach exploration. Uh, oh, we should have fixed our crossbows and stuff. But we've got to. <laughs> Shut up, Dodo. Try to talk. You were... Did we just knock that tree down in one shot? Did we get that dodo's bits? We did not. I don't even know where that dodo went. Just went into the ether. Um, but yeah, anyways, I said we need to go on a murdering spree to harvest up the hide and hunt a pteranodon along the beach shores. Oh my god, look at that, you guys. It's so beautiful. If you guys want to know on the map where we are, Weathertop is our base. Um and it looks so different. Like, I would have liked to have built a base up there at some point in my lifetime. Um, it's just so unusually different. I, I just whole place looks like a new world to me. Um, uh, with all the different rocks, the formations, and all the bits and the bobs. It's just... Uh, hello. Uh, you know what? You're going to be our first victim. You are going to be our first victim on our way to gather the hide. You can't run away. You can't run away. You can't get away. Oh, somebody got a level out of that. Did I get a level out of that? Oh, Jessica got a level out of that. Jessica, let's put that into your melee damage. Yeah. All right, so what did we need? Like 200 and some odd change? Either way, let's get about 300 hide before we try to attempt the PT saddle. Then we can also use Jessica here to uh, gather up prime meats. So we can do a little bit faster taming on said pteranodon. And it's so nice to be able to use regular meat from the hunted when we were doing that instead of fish meat. Speaking of pteranodons, what's your level, homie? 10 negative Ghost Rider. You will not make the cut. However, this jack butt can 
Yeah! <laughs> Stupid. There's some more hide. I'm into it. Oh, another pteranodon. 45. What about you? Oh, you're not a pteranodon. You're the worst thing of all time. All right, there are our tamed sharks. And at some point, I'm gonna still try to build us a bridge across this, because this swimming bit is not fun. It takes a very long time to get across the water. But anyways, guys, that's kind of what we're gonna do. We're gonna try to harvest up enough hide to build the saddle, and we're gonna hunt us a pteranodon along the beaches and do a little exploring. Burbs. And we're back, gang. We've just been wandering along, and I haven't found any, um... Oh, oh, it's like that, is it? I haven't found, I was trying to say before, I was really interrupted. <laughs> I haven't found any good pteranodons. There's a beaver. Oh, you scared me, man. Uh, and then I found, oh, baby parasaurs. And we found the beaver dam. So we're going to rob this beaver dam right now. Like so. We're going to jump back up on you. We're going to get rid of all the wood because we don't need it. But we want to keep these uh, this cementing paste. And this beaver's going to come over here in rage mode. We destroyed that dam. Where you at, beaver? You haven't gone rage mode yet. Oh, here he comes. Oh, were we outside of his, like, mad circle? Oh, there's another one right there sticking out of the water. That's why. He's like, ha, joke's on you, fool. You missed my other house. That was the decoy house. Look at that water, you guys. How amazing is that? I can't even wrap my brain around how beautiful this is. I've actually been snapping screenshots like left and right, so I might post them on the um, on the Twitter or maybe my Instagram. It's about the closest to a vacation I've been in forever. I really want to rob that beaver dam, but I need this level 10 beaver to go away. You, come here, level 10 beaver. I need to bite your face. Come here, stupid. Hey, come here. Let me kill you. Stand still. I was swimming around being, doing what be beavers do. Yeah, boy! Oh, now all you guys want some of this? Oh, yeah. Give me the hot level action. I found the explorer note. Oh, you want to come for some too? Oh, you, you, your friends? It's like a piranha party! Oh, my God. We got a level. Ah, melee damage, of course. All right, let's rob this beaver dam. Are you going to move? Like, seriously? There you go. All right, so we found beaver dams. That's amazing. Oh, it's a little framey right here. I'm not going to lie. I do have my settings turned up a little bit higher uh, than I've been playing on. Um, so you're probably going to notice a little bit of little stutter here and there. Um, I got the freaking thing fixed, though, so we don't have to deal with the problems we've been having. Oh, hello there, the piranha. Oh, you want to? You want to? You want to? You want to? I don't think you do. That's exactly what I thought. Oh, thanks for your help, Jessica. To be fair, though, she might be on neutral. All right, let's just go ahead and spit all the wood out because we don't need any of that. We'll take the bits. Oh, I'm into it. Oh, baby. Raiding beaver dams. I feel like, you know, I probably just did this not that long ago in an old arc, but I feel like I haven't done it ever in my life now. Oh, and so we, we got to drop. So we've got some... Tripwire alarms, which is stupid. Got another forge, which we can use, but we got 373 cementing paste. Oh, dude. That's going to help a lot over at the base. There's a few things we probably need to build with it. What? I do not know. But we have not found a decent pteranodon. The highest level one I've seen so far has been a 75. And I'm just... Stonehenge, guys. I should have showed you Stonehenge. We'll sh I'll show you guys Stonehenge maybe on my way back. Because Stonehenge is unbelievably amazing. Uh, it looks so good and so different. I mean, you can see it from here, and it's just something else. I mean, this... Oh, man. And, and I just got the alert. I don't know if you guys saw the updates, but they've put out something like eight patches in the last 24 hours. They said that's like the most in wildcard history. They're working hard, guys. They're working really hard to make this game uh, what it should be. Uh, and it, it's already it's already really great. All right, what do we got? 10. I cannot find a good one to save my life. 45. Oh, oh that trike scared me so bad. I'm nervous to run into an alpha because I, I really don't think we can take an alpha. Oh, little baby trike, what's up, buddy? 
Why are baby drakes? Oh, I saw some baby carbonemesis Carbonemesis earlier, and they are freaking cute. They may have one cutest animal, uh, baby animal in the game, even more though, more so than trikes. God, we are fat. Probably could get rid of a lot of this stuff. You don't need all this on you. All right, cool. There we go. The boxes even stack all nice and neat. You see that? <laughs> oh, this place is so great. And it's, it's crazy because the water's shallow. They changed the water here. I don't know if there used to be water right here. Uh, so that's a thing. What is that? You guys see that red thing in the water? Well, uh, I guess it was a dead thing in the water. You ate it. I didn't even get a chance to see it, you jerk. I was trying to see what was in the water, but no. <laughs> Not today. All right, were you one of those trash trasho ones? Yeah, a level 15. You're definitely a trash. Definitely trash. It's really bright, this game. I gam it down even, but, you know. Looks good, though. Looks good. All right, guys. We're going to continue the journey. Looking for the uh, elusive. I'm thinking at least a level 100. I'm not going to be too picky. If I, maybe a 95 even. Something I can fly on. And we're back, guys. And we're still on the hunt. But if you guys are watching my uh, paleo Island Extinct CI, this is where our house was on that map. Here is the Explore note, and just look at this area, though. This is insane. Stegosaurus Regium has approximately Stegosaurus Regium. So, there's back. Herb Island right there, and it looks so cool. Uh, this whole area, I, I'm just blown away. I can't say it enough. I, I'll probably say it 125 more times. Oh, we're going to make you a murder machine. Uh, we got to fight with a skeletal trike. So that was the thing that happened. Uh, this is unbelievable. This cliffside looks... Un oh, of course, there's a drop coming down up there. Uh, can't do anything about it. Oh, aren't you the neatest little compy of all time? And now you're the deadest little compy of all time. Oh, is your friends coming now? Bring it, stupid. Oh, you're a tough little guy. Not that tough. Harden to shield it from attack. <laughs> She's still talking. Alignment that deals crippling blows. I have no idea what we need to do to find a freaking uh, decent Tyrannodon. Like I said, at this point, I'd settle for like a 90. Uh, the highest level I've seen is the one closer to where our base is currently. And that was like a 75. We're, we are not finding anything good. Oh, look at the little dry. You little fella. Oh, man. She's still talking. appendage also helps the gathering berries. In case you guys want to hear it. Go figure. There is an Iguanodon. Iguanodon. These cliffs are unbelievable. I just can't even wrap my brain around how just amazing this looks. Now, we are getting into, like, Raptor Alley. Uh, I wouldn't mind a Raptor either, but, again, we've got a long walk home. I've been playing now for well over an hour. I've only got about 15 minutes of footage recorded. All of this has been just walking and searching for Tranodons. Uh, so that that's the thing, and I'm sure all my prime meat's about to go bad. It sure is. What's up there, little fellow? Level 30? Nah. Look at all the dodos. There's a lot of them over here. I was thinking about maybe building my base up there, but I've got an idea. I'm thinking what I'm going to do. As I'm very much thinking I'm going to build my base. If you guys remember, and it's it's in my YouTube channel. Like a year ago, I did a solo uh, series. I called it Vanilla-ish for Beginners, and it took place around Christmas. And I built kind of near the swamps and redwoods. And I'm feeling like I may build there again. Because uh, we never really built it up, because I never finished that series. It's kind of a little story of my life right there. Um, so that's the thing. Oh, we're getting so framey. It's so framey. Uh, this is unbelievable. I wish there was a dino tracker. <laughs> I would be using it right about now. You guys. Oh, look at the raptor baby. Oh, that's amazing. I'd tame you if it wasn't like 20 miles home. Well, we might have to settle for that, um, consolation prize iguanodon. Uh, since we have not found the PT that we've been looking for. These are not the PTs we're looking for. I'll just hit you out of frustration. Yeah, stupid. Guys, I had to bring you back in. During this thunderstorm, look at the light coming off of Green Ob. That is absolutely insane. 
I cannot believe how crazy that looks. I am so tempted right now, you don't even know, to like get into some straight up photo mode and get a photo of that. That is absolutely bonkers. I cannot believe how crazy it is. I am definitely gonna take a screenshot of that though. Oh my God, that is, oh my God, that's amazing. I'm glad I put the blooms and light shafts back on. Uh, we may end up getting a, <laughs> it might be a little cheaty, but we might end up getting an Argentavis baby from uh, one of the tribe members because, uh, guys, I've been looking for an hour and a half. We could build a raft and go experiment over uh, at, um, I don't know what's going on right there. Uh, but we, uh, like I was saying, we could build a raft and go check out Herb Island. Oh, I'm into that. Why don't we do that? And then we can always grab some of the vegetables and we can maybe find a decent Anki over there while we're at it. I think that's an amazing idea. Yeah, I agree. You guys were, I, I know you guys are amazing. I'm glad you guys thought of that too, because we are on the same page as of right now. And there's our raft. Look at it, you guys, in all of its glory. Let's see if we can turn off the sail. Can we? Drive, tracking, options. Adios. Okay, so now we need to get some foundations. Uh-oh. Is that what I think it is? Uh, is it just a shark? Yeah, it's just a shark. I thought it was a lead sick. These like, I was like, oh, God, please don't already be one already. All right, so let's get some foundations crafted up. Oh, we're running low on food. Not great. Uh, all right, so let's go ahead... And we've got wood, and we've got thatch. How many foundations can we craft up right now? Wood foundations. How many? Two? One. Okay, we'll build the one. <laughs> I'm into it. Let's see if we can build a few more. All right, let's get some... Get some thatch. Hot thatch action. All right. I'm into it. Oh, uh, what caused that tree to fall down right there? Was it me? Die! Yeah, I said we get some foundations placed down onto this. Now, there's a way supposedly to lower these foundations, and I don't know how to do it exactly. So let's do this together and see if this will be a learning process. Oh, no, no, don't drive it. Let's get right in the middle of it. Alright, so now, if we plop down this foundation, how do you... It's going to... How do you raise... No, that's not it. There's supposed to be a way to raise and lower these foundations, and I don't know how. Go into K mode. Zoom out. I feel like that's a little bit crooked. A little crooked that way. Probably okay this way, but but again, how the hell do you... Uh, raise and lower this thing? I don't know. Oh, wait. Oh, I got it. Oh, that's awesome. Aha! So once you place it in green mode, then you just use your mouse to go up and down. Tip of the day, guys. All right, let's finish some more wood foundations. How many can we build? Two? All right, I'm into it. All right, guys, let me foundation this bad ombre up, and I'll bring you guys back in. And we're back, gang, and the raft is more or less done. I went ahead and plopped down that other... It's not the most amazing raft I've ever built, but it is absolutely functional. Uh, let's head over to Herb Island. Can we drive the raft now? Uh-oh. Uh, I don't know if we can do this now. This foundation bit might have to go, to be perfectly honest. No worries. We got this. I might not have put it lower, low enough, because on my old raft, I had them all the way down. And let's just hope there's no lead sickies to just eat us now. All right. I feel like we need to go find an Anki. I can be, if we can find a couple decent ones, we can bring two of them back. Um, I've got plenty of Trank Arrows. So it shouldn't be a problem. I just don't know if I have enough. And actually, to be honest, uh, we could harvest metal up there. We could get a smithy throw. Let us listen to all those fish. That's so weird. It's really creepy, kind of. But um, what I was saying is we could build a smithy, and we could absolutely repair our crossbows. And I think I'm going to get into that. And, uh, God, I wish we could see a drop on the beach. But this, oh, my God, look at this. 
Uh, this is going to be our first time out to Herb Island. I'm really excited about this, to be perfectly honest with you. Um, hopefully, hopefully we have some good hunting. I love these new rocks and new rocks out in the water. They did a great job with the landscaping. All right. And who knows? Maybe we'll find a decent Pteranodon. I would check these guys' levels, but I don't want to stop in this water even for a little bit until we get a little closer to shore and we don't have to worry about something weak, uh, scary. Oh, look at that water. Tell me about yourself. Oh, I think you're absolute garbage. Level five. Uh, is that a purple drop? Level 40. Excuse me there. All right, let's do some looking around. I think this is where um, Drew might be building his base. I can't remember. I forgot. But let's get some metal and then we can start cooking it up and we can build our own little smithy uh, on there. We have a forge, so then we, like, we'll have to get our smithy going. And uh, we can repair our bits. Uh, let's not try to jump over that. Damn, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm regretting a little bit not making my character taller. I mean, I did make him a tiny bit taller than what he spawned in as. Oh, it's a purple drop too, I believe. Please have good stuff. I'm just gonna pull it in, and now we're gonna look. What did we get? What did we get? Can I can I open my stuff? We got oh my god, the most amazing fur gloves of all time. Um, we got some Calian soup. We got some bug repellent, and that was about it. So nothing spectacular. And there's some metal rocks right here. Uh, hello, the PT. Tell me about yourself, please. 15. Amazing. Oh, they're so bad. Oh, these metal rocks are insane. Oh, did you see the sparks? Get out of here. That is crazy. Unbelievable. I had no idea. That should be enough to get us everything we need to do some repairs and what have you. And then we're going to scour this place looking for some dinos. I don't remember all these rocks being right here, though, back in the OGs. So, that's a thing. I felt like you had a pretty clean run all the way around. So, we didn't need all the extra rocks. Dear Wild Card did not need all of the extra stone. But, there it is. I had to hydrate myself. What level are you, the Bronto? Five! Woo! We got some... We got some winners up in here. I feel like we can take a level five Bronto with uh, Jessica. Cool. So we can get, get that going. Oh, there's a baby Bronto too. Uh, what level are you baby Bronto? Usually they're the same level as their parent. Yeah, level fives. So I don't think it's worth doing anything with, but I definitely do think it's worth trying to kill that, uh, that bad hombre. Uh, let's go ahead and kill some of this stuff. Let's do it. Let's get in a fight with his level 5 Bronto. Why wouldn't you? Actually, let's go get that Explorer note first. Then we'll get in a fight with his level 5 Bronto. Oh, there it is. Right there. How do you know? What a, what an amazing thing. Possessing the appearance of a half-duck, half-dinosaur, Hesperonis I, I is a medium-sized wanna... fish-eating bird. Common in the rivers What's up, level 5 Bronto? Hitting us for 18? the height of a human if it stood tall, but it rarely does. Can we not instill bleeding effects on you? Weird. Oh, we killed it pretty quick, though. Did we get a level out of that? We did. We got we got two levels. So we could, in fact, tame that baby Bronto, but I'm not gonna. Let's do some wandering. See if we can find some decent dinos to tame. Not particularly useful for hunting. I don't see anybody claim stake. Oh, 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 what are you level? Kept for the eggs be decent. After consuming much fish. 95, there it is. That could be our winner, winner, chicken dinner right there, guys. And we should have some primes. We sure do. As soon as this clown lands, let's just check this white one real quick just to see. And the other is an oily liquid. Thank you, it sure is. The same as the oil found in the ocean. The oil found in the ocean? Okay, that's the junk level. All right, where'd the 95 run off to? What are you, my dude? 15, not great. You're not really good tame, a good, good tameable dino. All right, let's... Oh, God, we need to get this one. Where you at there, big fella? Where'd you run off to? Oh, which way are you going, man? Come back! 
Come hang out with us, dude. Come over to this side of the, the water. This is the best side. We need to get this guy to land. I wish there was a way to bait them in, you know? We're absolutely going to go for this, dude. So, uh, I don't know how long it's going to take him to decide to, like, land. Oh, oh, he's coming down. Oh, he's coming down. Is he going to land? Like, all right, guys. I think he's landed. He, she, it. Oh, stupid tree's in my way. Yes. Right in your brain. Go to sleep. And you're out. Oh, I'm into that. Amazing. All right, let's grab a bunch of this prime. Oh, I hear a Basilosaurus. I had to get naked, you guys, because I was overheating. What's up, big fella? Would you like some of my meat? All right. So hopefully, we won't need a narcotic on this guy. I hope. But here we are. We've got a pteranodon. Now, if we could just find a decent Anki over here, like maybe, you know, for the for the community center, at least a 50, maybe a little higher. Uh, I'm not looking for perfection. Oh, that's great. When will you want to eat? Where's your food at? Oh, not great. Okay. Well, that's the thing. Uh, you're the 15. Yeah, we kind I feel like we should kill you. But I need you to get away from that guy so you don't hurt him. Right, I don't want to start a fight with the trikes because then all of them. Oh, wait, there's another, another Anki right here. You're in my way. 45? That might work for the community center. Uh, let's let's try to pull a double tame action, shall we? But then your buddy's gonna come after me. Alright, let's let's Oh yeah, that PT will be tamed up no time flat. Enjoy. Enjoy. I kind of feel like I should have. Oh, you coming? Find your brain place. Kite, kite, kite. <laughs> I'll just keep kiting you around this rock. You got a neat color. I'm into it. Woof, just in time. All right, let's harvest up some berries, guys. We got a twofer. I'm into it. All right, let's get some stuff to chain you up with. It's not just fiber. That would be amazing. We get some berries? Uh, oh, there was, oh my, oh my God. <laughs> oh my God, we're naked and we're overheating. How many berries do we have on us? Not a lot. What's the temperature? Oh, 113 degrees. Oh my god. Yeah, we need to find some good cloth armor too. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be like picking berries out of your butt. Uh, we probably should need to find some decent cloth armor to carry on us too for this reason. Uh, I've noticed the island's temperature fluctuations are insane. Oh yeah, no time flat. We got this. All right. And it looks like our pteranodon is going to be close as well. And I think... I think we still have enough stuff to build up a saddle. I think I put all, all that crap away, though. I may have put all the crap away. Yeah. Oh, no. Can we use this? 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 Crafting. PT. We need hide. A little bit more hide. Done. Oh, baby. We did it. I'm into it. So now we have a saddle for you. All right. Let's put all this crap back on you and get rid of that. Awesome, you guys. Oh, we've got him. There's our PT. Oh, uh, is your head broken? Oh, that was weird. <laughs> that was the stupidest thing. <laughs> what happened to you? Oh, my God. All right, guys. We did a two for tame. We're killing it today. All right. Can you land? Awesome. Let's go ahead and put... One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. And I feel like this temperament four, five. Near the presence of injured creatures. Hyenodon quickly becomes very aggressive. All right, let's um. I can stay right here. All right, guys, we'll tame up this Anki and Wolverbs, and we're back at base, you guys. Uh, we did discover there is in fact a lead sickies in the water. Uh, it beat the holy living crap out of the boat. It broke my stuff. Not all of it, but quite a bit of it. This guy needs weight already. I can tell. In a bad way. 
but he's gonna be a decent little anky for everybody to use he can collect, gather flint stone he'll get some metal too out of some of these rocks i love when it rains i love that the world is wet but you can really tell without the ground clutter turned on because the ground is shiny and that is unbelievably cool so anyways guys i think that's gonna do it for this episode they're a little bit long but there's so much to do in these videos i don't even know how to get it all done so anyways guys don't forget smash that thumbs up button subscribe if you're new here feel free to share a favorite the video as you see fit and as always jc hooligan signing out and you have a great rest of your day.